Now to the timing of Ken Griffin's big announcement today. He's moving his hedge fund Citadel to South Florida out of Chicago. For months, Griffin poured millions into the GOP race for governor here. CBS 2's Jackie Kostak live for us outside Citadel Center in the loop. And Jackie, this news just days before the big primary caught a lot of people by surprise and got a lot of attention too. It sure did. Joe, Ken Griffin poured $50 million into Richard Irvin's struggling campaign for governor. But in an email to Citadel employees this morning, he made no mention of politics. As the race for governor heats up just days before the primary, one of Richard Irvin's key donors is jumping ship. The, the ultimate decision probably had very little to do uh, with the gubernatorial election. While Ken Griffin has poured millions into Irvin's struggling campaign, CBS2 political analyst Stephen Caliendo says not so fast in connecting the big business move to the political candidate. I can't imagine that the timing of it was, was placed really related to the election as much as uh, taking the opportunity, both he and Richard Irvin taking the opportunity to talk about what it means that companies are moving out of Chicago a couple of days before the election. The hedge fund billionaire Ken Griffin founded in Chicago more than 30 years ago, Citadel now joins Boeing and Caterpillar as the third major company to recently announce a major headquarters move out of the Chicago area. That while well, Kellogg announced a move to Chicago. In a memo to Citadel employees, Griffin described Miami as a vibrant, growing metropolis that embodies the American dream. A spokesperson points to Florida's business friendly climate and Chicago's violence as reasons for the move, saying, quote, talent wants to live in cities where they feel safe. That point is one Caliendo believes Richard Irvin, who's campaigned as a tough on crime candidate, will try to hammer home even after his big time donor moved out. Well, I think what Richard Irvin will seize on is the, is the um, earlier comments I think that Griffin made about crime in Chicago and that members of uh, you know his team, his, his employees have been involved in crime, have been mugged and so forth. The, people get mugged in Miami too, you know what I mean? It's like, it's not anything unique except for that there is some political utility. A Citadel spokesperson made it clear tonight that the company will still have a presence here in Chicago right now. They have more than a thousand employees that work here. No word yet on how many will remain. Jackie Kostek, CBS 2 News. Jackie, thank you.